What's up guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and in this video I'm going to be sharing a new bypass discovered in iOS 8.1. Now this is going to be a little bit different. It's not the same as a lock screen bypass, but it's just as big of a vulnerability. And this does work in iOS 8.0.2, 8.0, iOS 7. I don't know about iOS 6, haven't tested it, but this is crazy. I was surprised to find this. So here's what it is. Now it will allow you to get into touch ID and passcode right here and the restriction settings by means of brute force. So that means you're gonna to have to guess the password, but it does give you the ability to guess the password unlimited attempts. And it's crazy that this is still found in the latest 8.1. I'm gonna show you, I am running it on my iPhone 6, and this does work on every device, iPads, iPhones, and iPod touches. So it gives you unlimited passcode attempts into getting into touch ID and passcode, and if we go into general and restrictions. So, let me tell you something. I mean, for some this might not be a big deal, but let's say a company or a school distributes iPods, iPads, whatever to their students and uh, or workers, and they restrict it. So you can't go into certain applications or certain settings to mess around, but by using this exploit, it gives you the means to get in there by brute force, you know, just guessing the password a million times. And that wouldn't be a very good thing to happen to that company or school, you know, those people getting into the certain areas of the device where they're not supposed to. So let's go ahead and see how this works. Now, first off, I wanna show you, I do have a passcode and you know, obviously I can't get in without it. So let me just put in six failed attempts. So there you go, it says wait one minute. Okay, so one minute has passed. I'm gonna go back in here and I'm gonna make it five minutes. So it's telling me I have to wait five minutes. Now I'm gonna do the same for restrictions and okay so now let's go ahead and change the time that's all it is all you guys got to do is go into date and time disable set automatically and then just move it forward however much time it takes you know how much time it asked you go into here and you get to do the next attempt so now it says 15 minutes and same thing for restrictions inside of here and go ahead and input the next attempt without having to wait that five minutes so if you guys can see that's all you have to do. So I'm just gonna move that time forward again. And um, move it forward a couple hours. So you can just keep guessing. I mean, move the time forward, come back, input another guess. Now eventually it goes to 60 minutes and it stays at 60 minutes. And that's the same thing for both of them. And eventually, you know, if you're resilient, you can find that passcode. But I just wanted to highlight that this vulnerability does exist in iOS 8.1, and it's so simple to do. All you gotta do is change the time and keep guessing. So this video is gonna help bring this bug to light. Hopefully Apple patches this soon in the next software update, but I can't see people being really affected by this. It's more of schools or organizations or you know even parents that restrict their devices, or you know if you give your device to a friend, unlocked they can guess your password whatever but guys so it's just as simple as that you know all you have to do is change your time and you can get unlimited passcode attempts to get into there anyways hope you enjoyed this little bypass video have a great day guys peace